So hey guys, welcome back to my channel for tutorials. So guys, today I'll teach you how I create this type of beautiful concept art scene with using EV render. See guys, that's my random composition. Okay, it's really cool. Okay, so now guys, I show you my texture. So click on here. See guys, that's my simple texture. And now guys, I show you my final render. So I click on here and go to on camera angle. Yeah. See guys, that's my beautiful composition. It's really good. So now guys, it's really simple and best tutorial for beginners. Guys, you can download these assets and project file from my website. It's free. So guys, now I teach you how I create this type of concept art scene. So guys, create new and don't save. So guys, select all and press delete key. So first of all, guys, I'm going to take a landscape. This one, ANT landscape. Yes, and guys go to on presets here, presets change, guys I use mountain one like this and guys I increase segments, this one, subdivision, like 256 is good for me, 256, enter, yeah, and guys now I change random seat like this, yes, much better, right, okay, so now Guys, little bit increase size, so scale size increased like this, yeah. And guys, smaller, high decrease, yes. Okay, so next one, guys, I take more landscape. So guys, wireframe check. And guys, I take more landscape. Yes, and guys, I change seat randomly. Okay, so guys, go to on here. And... Guys, rotate, rotate like this and increase height, height increase, yes. See guys, that's my mountain and now guys, I take camera and guys, camera check. Guys, go to on back and up. Guys, here set your camera angle. So guys, select your camera and guys, rotation 90, 0 and 0, yes. And guys, go to on back. Yeah. Okay, so guys select and this one decrease this height. Yes, and select this one. And guys duplicate, press Ctrl C and V. Go to on here. Yeah. And guys rotate this landscape. So rotate like this randomly. Yeah. Okay, so now guys I take more landscape. So again, mesh and landscape check. Guys, I change seed. Okay, so guys, like a four is good. I take four. Enter. Yes. So guys, go to on back. So guys, go to on camera, press zero. Yes. And go to on down. Yeah. Great. Right. Okay, so now guys, I apply spare for like a planet. So guys, go to on add and UV spare. Guys, I increase segments like 120 and bring like 60. Yes. And guys, scale size change. So press 0 and up. Guys, y-axis change like this. And guys, Z1. Yes, good. Guys, select this landscape and go to down. And here, actually mid one is good. Okay, see guys, that's my spare. And guys, little bit back, like this, yeah, good, right? Okay, so now, guys, I apply this time background light. So guys, this time I use torus and increase segments, segments increase, like this, yes, right? Okay, so guys, go to on here, rotation, change, 90. Enter, guys scale size change, so S letter change, press 0, and go to our up, yeah, guys location, Y axis, go to our back, yes, right, it's really simple, and go to on here, yes, okay, so now guys I change, this time, torus thickness, this one thickness, so guys go to our edit mode, and shortcut command is press A letter, all selection, and Alt S. And guys, 
क्वेर शेप लाइक दिस यस गर्ल राइट दैट्स माय रिंग सो गाइस प्रेस जीरो एंड गाइस स्केल साइज इंक्रीज लाइक दिस या आई सेट योर लाइट बैकग्राउंड लाइट लिटिल बिट डाउन या इट्स गुड यस सी गाइस दैट्स माय कंपोजिशन सो गाइस दिस टाइम आई अप्लाई मोर ऑब्जेक्ट सो सेलेक्ट दिस वन लैंडस्केप एंड गाइस क्लोजर लाइक दिस प्रेस जीरो यस एंड गाइस स्केल साइज चेंज दैट्स माय हाइट चेंज लाइक दिस या ओके सो नाउ गाइस आई अप्लाई दिस टाइम डुप्लीकेट लैंडस्केप एंड गो टू ऑन हाइट increase same like this press zero and guys go to on back yeah scale size increase yes much better so guys that's my simple composition right okay so now guys i apply more sphere select this one and duplicate press control c and v and guys go to on back like this and scale size smaller yes and guys duplicate go to on here and up yes see guys that's my simple composition okay so now guys i apply 3d model guys i have 3d model so import guys you can download 3d model from my website it's free like this and scale size 0.1 and import check yes guys scale size change press s letter scale size change and go to our up guys wireframe uncheck and guys scale size same smaller and rotate rotate like this and guys set your composition like this yes see guys that's my like a spaceship right it's really cool okay so now guys i apply more this one and right click guys select hierarchy and duplicate so go to on here guys i create duplicate scale size change and rotate rotate like this guys apply on this one here and up go to on camera yes See guys, that's my second spaceship. Okay, so now guys select all and shade smoother. Okay, so guys I apply one more object. So guys this time import and select this one zero point one. Yes, and scale size smaller like this. Guys, you can download this all project material and guys. That's my object, three D object. Download from my website. It's free. Smaller. Yes. See guys, that's my simple composition. It's really good. And lastly, guys, I apply three D character. So import, guys. That's my OBJ format file. And same text up. Select and scale size zero point one. And import. Yes. Guys, scale size smaller, like this. Yes, more. Okay, so guys, go to an up and rotate. Yes, see guys, that's my three D composition. It's really good, right? It's so easy, guys. Okay, so guys, now I apply material one by one. So guys, firstly, I apply material for this landscape. So go to on. Here, guys, I use Blender Kit add-on and type rock. Enter. See, guys, that's my different different style of material. So, guys, you can apply any materials depend on your work. But I like something different. Guys, you can apply this one. Same, apply on here. Yes. So, guys, click on here. Yeah. See guys, that's my rock material. It's really good. So guys, now I change displacement. So guys, select your landscape and I change displacement. 
so guys go to one shading and guys select your rock node closer see guys that's my simple node and see guys that's my displacement and scale size decrease like a 0 0.2 is good for me okay so guys press 0 and layout check and guys click on here okay so now guys go to one EV render and make loser check, bloom power check and screen space check yes okay so next thing guys I apply light for this one so guys click on here yes and guys I apply light glow light so guys create new material so guys I change emission color I like orange color code is 0 0.024 and you 1 and 1 all strength I like 300 is good and material name like a glow yes so guys select your ring and apply it yeah it's good okay so now guys apply on here 3d objects like this select mid one and apply glow material and guys same select closer select this one glow and guys go to on here select this one ring and apply glow yes okay so guys select your 3d object and little bit change skin size like this yes okay so now guys select your character and create new material so guys I go to on here roughness 0 0.3 is good okay so now guys same apply material on here that's my rock material and apply and apply okay, it's really simple and lastly apply this one yes okay so now guys this time I apply material for the spear so same guys I apply rock material yeah guys more see guys I like this one so apply and guys click on here yes see guys that's my rock material but guys you can change only UV so guys go to on shading and guys go to on note yeah that's my note and I change scale size so guys closer and see guys that's my mapping and scale size I like 4 and 4 yes much better yes really good okay so now guys go to on layout that's my material and apply same select and guys apply same alien rock like this and apply and apply rock yeah really good see guys that's my material right okay so now guys I apply light so use guys use side light so go to one area light and here like this and rotate same 90 degree minus 90 and up like this you okay so guys I like your light and I change color guys I like blue color 0 0.6 saturation 1 guys power I like 200 yes okay so now guys I like your light and duplicate so guys rotate rotate like this yes 180 degree okay see guys that's my side light and now guys I apply top light so duplicate and go to on here on mid one rotate rotate like this I save minus 90 enter right see guys that's my top light okay so guys select your top light and I change power power I like only 20 yes so press 0 and guys go to on camera and final render preview yes see guys that's really cool okay so now guys I apply black background so go to on world property here and color I like black like this yes much better and also guys I apply fog effect so guys go to on here and guys you can create also light for this one so guys select your light this one top light and duplicate press ctrl c and v 
and guys rotate like this yes okay so guys select your light and i changed light color guys i like orange color orange and power like a 250 is good for me yes and guys little bit rotate yes really cool okay so guys go to on here and click on final render preview yes and also guys that's not looking so good create like a cinematic effect so use fog so guys go to on shading and word this one and guys i apply this time principal volume like this and guys connect with volume and density i like 0.1 is good enter so guys layout and click on here yes see guys that's really cool it's really like a cinematic effect right it's really good okay so now guys i apply last simple spare glowing spare so guys click on here yeah and use guys save your project is most important part new okay so guys i take spare uv spare simple and spare guys segments like a 32 and i take like a 20 is good okay so right click shade smoother and smaller let's go to on camera here and i select your spare and up like this see guys that's my spare and little bit down yes okay so guys i create new material like a glow to emission and same 0 0.024 and 1 guys strength i like a 100 and press 0 and little bit up yes okay so guys duplicate go to on here like this and guys apply randomly yes and guys duplicate apply on here and up like this guys little bit more yes right it's really cool okay so now guys select both spare this one and this one and duplicate yes and guys closer press zero and go to down like this guys change both location yes okay so guys now go to one final render preview yes it's really cool see guys that's my new style of cinematic lighting right okay see guys that's my final render it's really looking good so guys go to on render setting and guys render 128 and viewport 32 is good yes guys i show you my final render so render image check yes see guys that's my final render it's looking so so realistic okay so guys that's it my final tutorial is finished so if you like my video please share and subscribe my youtube channel and guys you can download project file from my website it's free thank you